everyone, I'm Wood Spoonie, and I'm Terry Cruz, and this is the NBA 2K24 of the preseason. We welcome you back here for our next part of the game. As for day two, wrapping up the British season, before the tip-off starts here for the first game, we've got our last two heavy competitions since season five, and this is where it turns out the last two in a Western Conference matchup right in between the alley. You may never know who they are, but that's all it does turn out, a special in between. We've got Grizzlies on Suns. These are the last two that will be here to play them again, one by one. Now you never know that Ja Morant has a lot of great responses and turning out big. His percentage is turning out a terrific moment. As for CP, he's out of here, and now with the Golden State Warriors. We all miss him very much, but we are happy enough to bring with Stephen Curry, and definitely on the other side of it, KD is back with Devin Booker. They are just going to be on fire for tonight, and we have to see what goes which, if they're going to keep on going from their team. This is all it does turn out with transfer to transfer. For the start of in between for the Rockets, the Clippers, and then the team of the Suns after the OKC Thunders. This was all it does turn out to be a lot of separation by switch by switch. Nothing was going to take him down like it's a champ. Yeah, it always does. For one reason, they're going to get it right down there and then they're going to find out how they're going to get it fast. And here are the starting groups as right now Memphis Grizzly has John Moran. Desmond Bain, Dylan Brooks, Jaron Jackson Jr., and Steven Adams, the tall guy in the center. And on the other side of the Phoenix Suns, Chris Paul, Devin Booker, Josh Okoji, Kevin Durant, and DeAndre Ayton. We are going to be seeing who's going to make a next win and take it all down. We now send you down to Footprint Center. As for standing by, we have Miss Kevin Harden, along with Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge will be on the sideline here as well. We'll see you back later for the post-game show. And halftime coming up will be another two to bring it on. That will be Chuck and, of course, the Kenny the Jump Smith. Let's get to it. Enjoy the last game, and the regular season starts on December 3rd. 2K Sports welcomes you to a following presentation of the NBA. Now here's Paul. 
I'm talking to the back of Durant. And he's coming! No way! Oh, with the assist on that one. Inside, Durant's scoring instincts take over, helping him find the path to that difficult shot. Back to Morant. Foul on the Suns. Number 35, Kevin Durant. His first personal foul, first team foul. On the line from Memphis Grizzlies, John Morant. He's going to get a line with you. From Morant. Al Gray got disappointing ending to the playoffs last season, certainly for the Phoenix Suns. Well, came in the top seed in their conference only to make a second round exit after a grueling game seven. So this season might be revenge time for this group. Oh, free throws, good from Morant. And you know, for proof of what Morant's done for the Memphis franchise, look at the offense. Grizzlies have made Huge steps every year. Devin Booker! Booker's just one of those guys that can hit you at all three levels. Outside, Bain. Pass to Brooks. Rebounded by the Andre. Great the improvement since Moran arrived has been very steady. And the Grizzlies went from the top of the Grizzlies foul. Number 12, John Moran. He scores first goal foul. First team foul. Out of line for the Suns. Number 3, Chris Paul. Out of line for 2. Kogi. 
Tori and Craig. First quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. Craig and Hyman Bayambo. This ball over here by the Sun. Booker outside. SDKD releases. No good that time. And Memphis the other way up. Here's Concho. Good for the basket. Cross Concho. One for one with that shot. Once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Easy possessions like that literally are just like him. You just dream of that. He will gladly take those. Here's Booker following the score by Memphis. Two minutes remaining. Two minutes remaining in the first quarter. Two minutes. Back to Booker. Seven. Booker. Seven points in the game. Crafty play by Booker inside. Navigating to a pretty big look at the basket. Jones picks the bane. Jones against Paul. Pass to Eldama. Jones, but he's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Shot clock at three. A 19 foot shot. And no good. Now the sun is still getting the other way. One more you are always from CP3. Fake chemistry, and it's true. When you ask these guys what makes your team special, they point out what a tight-knit group they are. Some people might not think chemistry is a big deal. It is huge. Three friends. And one thing is, if you look on paper, it can feel like you're speaking. But as you know, sometimes it doesn't translate to the real world. No, it does not translate. And then after that, if you don't have chemistry, that kind of profession, Ball passes to Durant. Book around son. Shoots from the elbow. The Grizzlies pull it in. Oh, I can see some miscommunication of defense there very clearly. They were super fortunate it didn't torch them with that mistake. Snatched up. So Booker will bring it up for the Zark. They lead by seven. Fires the three. And so it's the Phoenix Suns up by a dozen here at the end of the quarter. A look at the field goal percentage numbers tells the story of what tough defense they're playing today. Right back after this break. Basketball. This game has not exactly been neck and neck, but plenty of time left in this one. The guys, the Suns, enjoying a nice lead here. An impressive start. They came in with a well-conceived game plan and have executed. Well, let's see if they're able to keep it up. So far, their shot selection and ball movement has been on point. Suns leading by 12. So with Paul on the bench. Here's the group that Bonnie Williams has on the floor. The backcourt there for him, it's Payne and Booker. Turan is out there with DeAndre Ayton. And it's a Kogi, 83, the small field. DeAndre Ayton. It's good, Ayton. From Kevin Durant. Teams that led the league in threes, if they shot that same right now, would rank break, dead last in the NBA. So with that thought, which teams of yesteryear probably should have shot more threes? That's a good one. I think you gotta look back to the run TMC Warriors, right? And let's head over to the sideline and catch up with David Alder. Thank you, Kevin. Well, Kevin Durant learned an important lesson at age 11. His dad cooked him one on one, dunking on him and talking trash. Durant started crying and he locked himself in Luke the Luke and all. He came to realize, what am I so mad at? It's good to be passionate, but channel it. Once you're off the court, leave it, 
and go back to being you. Kevin. Advice. David thanks. And it's the Suns with the ball. Grizzlies making the shot. And out of bounds. Out of bounds. Possession. Miss ball. ball. So timeout call. Here. Timeout Memphis. And they just can't seem to get going offensively. And coach called his timeout to try and reset things on offense. The NBA 2K24 preseason is brought to you hard by American Express. Don't live life without it. State Farm. Talk, talk to an agent and call and get a free quote at 1 800 State Farm. And by Adidas, the official brand of the NBA. Those of you guys who are concerning of one of the better players in this game of Devin Booker, he is one of the fantastic players here that comes up with the Suns. They have definitely made him call the pro athlete of all time favorite. It is not true. When Devin Booker had it all in gray hands, he can just try to keep the range from insight and then have it all down with his special teammates that he can try to pick up the run. But it's simply how hard this is. But in most of that cases, they're going to get this done, and hopefully they will do more. That will be coming up here later for our halftime show. Let's get you back to Kevin Arnold. Kevin, it's all yours. Here's Kevin Arnold. Brooks outside. The best in Adams. Moran, it's just a chance. Is it to Kanan? Just find the shoot. And a lot of guns have come Done top. Oh, Number 35, Kevin Durant. The second personal foul. Second team foul. Shooting for the Federal Memphis Grizzlies. Number 10, Luke Kanan. So far. Now a line for juice. Substitution for the Phoenix Suns, number 10, Damian Lee. And good on the second, so he makes them both. We've seen the Suns get back to being one of the league's elite passing teams, RJ. That was the trademark of the Steve Nash era in the game. Tremendous fact. Number 24, Dylan Brooks. His first personal foul. Second team foul. DeAndre. I line for the Suns, number 22, DeAndre Aiden. And a line for two shots. Yeah, those will help you knock away a few shots or pluck down a few rebounds out of the air. That is no question. Durant. Aiton trying to break free. KD's 
Shot is off. The Grizzlies trail by 10. Brooks kicks to Jackson. And three off the mark. He's got a good pace for a battle. Almost a Kobe, the best to Aiden. The Andre! Aiden's got six. Round eight and lead. From Aiden understands the game plan and leads the game so well. That's to Adams. Right side, Jackson. The rebound by Katie. Boy, I'll give him an A for effort for trying to dump through the defense, but maybe he should ease up on that one just a little bit. That was a Kogi. Outside Durant. Here's Aiden. The Andre! From Katie. From Katie! He's got three assists in the game. And so Moran will bring it up for Memphis. The trail by 14. Brooks outside. A 15 footer. That one rolling around the runs out. The Suns have gone three of their first five shots to drop here in the second quarter. Now here's Payne. Freezing a violation on him. Who is this ball? A new substitution for the Phoenix Suns. Number eight, Carl Bayam. The Grizzlies trail by 14. Our timeout. Timeout. Memphis. You spent two seasons, Richard, with LeBron James in Cleveland. What was it like to play with LeBron? Well, I like to think that LeBron was playing with me the entire time. I should have rewarded that. I'm sorry. My respect. Now by Clark. Boss, 
Ryan Paul. Nice ball movement by Phoenix. Craig passes to Paul over Jones. Paul to Chris. Paul. There aren't a lot of guys in this league who shoot mid range of Paul. He's a year two. Well, you're right with that one. For Phoenix, they've gone 5 and 7 from the field here in the second. The pass to Ross. Here's Biombo. Back to Ross. Passes it to Biombo. Now, here's Craig. Like at 6. That shot missing. Outside, Jones. Pass to Bain. The end of the first half. Matthews Grizzlies, 23. Phoenix Suns, 34. And now we're saving it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks, Kevin. Chris, a very effective first half. What are you seeing that allows you to attack them so effectively? One of these games is very up tempo, fast pace. You know, they just run high, high up on it, you know, assisting the passing of the ball. So it's a fun game. Game's easy when you play downhill. Thanks, Chris. Back to you, Kevin. All right, thank you, David. And folks, don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello again, folks. Ernie Johnson here with Kenny the Jet Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. It's the NBA on 2K Sports, and let's talk the first half. Kevin Booker had it going on in the first quarter. He had 10 points and one assist. Let's hear from you, Shaq, on the Suns first half. The difference so far has been the efficiency of the offense. The ball movement is really good. I'm not afraid to use the whole shot clock if they have to. Overall, they're making every position count. How about you, Kenny? What'd you think about that? They didn't see the ball very well, and that's because they didn't have any flow on offense. I'd expect the coaching staff to make some tough in the process. They need to draw some plays to get a good offensive play. And that's going to do it for us here. The second half of action is coming your way. Thanks, guys. As of right now, time to send you back to Phoenix. Kevin Arlen, back to you. Time in the second half. We'll find out the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it has been a runaway. You know, guys, Devin Booker has been exceptional here. And how about the amount he's contributing in the scoring column? Through two quarters, he has been terrific. Always wants to be a go-to guy for them. I'm sure he'll be going for the ball even more in this half. And with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. Kicking off the second half. Kevin Durant! Uh, from Devin Booker. Jackson Jr. at the pole. The wingmen are Bain and Brooks. And Durant in a point. Here's Bain. Kevin Durant picking up that last pass. 13 feet away. And they recover it. Here's Durant. Here's Adams. And the foul foul number 35 given to Rank. It's for a principal foul. The last 14 foul. And the line for Memphis Grizzlies number four. Steven Adams. Taking two shots. The strongest guy in the And the first one at the line is good. And for Adams, his strength makes him difficult, Richard, to deal with. Oh, yes, yeah, the absolute worst. He sets some of the hardest screens on the lead, and he's been one of, if not the best offensive rebounders for over the last decade. Look, it takes multiple people to box out that large human. And so Adams nails both of them. Phoenix leading by 11. Rebounded by Jackson. And 
from Memphis. Her shooting about 33%. Now you have to climb that up. Morans against Booker. Hits it down. Sean Morant. Welcoming any physicality on his way out. Morant enjoys that type of challenge. That was a second look at a mobile one drive. Amazing control on display. There is no let up in this man. He is going to And he makes the first. 
Tillman, and he's checked in for Conjol. New substitution for New Memphis. Number two, Xavier Tillman. Field goal percentage. 
We'll get right back to the action when we return. the chance now, folks. Let's go to our State Farm assist of the game. And he sliced for the wide open with this speed. They had no chance to prevent that basket. That's an unguardable pass. Flat out. Give him credit for possessing that. as we head into the fourth quarter, but stranger things have happened. Ball and Booker, the talented backcourt pair. Andre Ayton out there with Durant, and it's a Kobe in the three spot. So that's the lineup on the floor for the Suns. And here's it, he'll bring it up for the Suns. Pass to a Kobe. Ball with the ball. Four on the clock. Chris Paul! There's that phase we talk about with Paul. Not rushing anything with the clock up against him. And here's Brooks from outside. Offensive rebound. Here's Adams. And another shot. Out to Brooks. The three ball. Phoenix grabs the miss. Aiton's got rebound number eight here tonight for the game. Ball left side. Inside, some nice ball movement here by the Suns. I'm 
by Ruffles, the official chip of the NBA. It is absolutely a fun one to watch and also enjoyable to watch the teams go by in between the Eastern Conference and Western Conference. What do you say? Yeah, this was a very excellent night, matching my game, and it's also a fantastic game to watch. I can really say that this was a, a perfect timing to say for this one here, Terry, because this was a, a perfect uh, a balance to make that one aggressive, more attempted, and taking control right from here. We'll see you later for the post game show, and right now, time for a new balance player of the game. Kevin, who do you have? <laughs> Substitution for the Phoenix Suns. Number 14, Lance Shepton. He's more gifted. Also, substitution number 21. What do you think of that? Well, DJ DJ Warren. Number 10, Damian Lee. Side Jordan. He did say greater, but more gifted. I think it's a conversation. Peyton hits him up. You just have to be enticed by the skill set. Of a uh, seven foot one behemoth who plays with a lot of physicality and skill on both ends. Back to Jones. 
Warren against Williams. Back to Jones, down low, and the tough to go. He saw that, I'll let him out. Beauty goes to the end. He goes to the end. Tom James. He's in that possession there, making the pass. Nice assist. Warren finds KD. Back to Warren. Nice ball movement by Phoenix. Five on the clock. This is to Durant. Kevin Durant from TJ Ward. Being comfortable and locked in throughout the night. You have to love their effort. This game wasn't handed to them. They took it. A three. Off the mark. That's the end of the game. Final score, Phoenix Suns, 71, Memphis, Arena. Thank you so much, Jerry Kevin Arlen, and we can't wait to see you here for the regular season as we are approaching our way soon. And we all catching in for the NBA play season tournament. Watch now by on, on the NBA app or on the ESPN Sports Channel Guide, right on TV, smartphone, or tablet. And last thing is to worry about the, what the game is. The Phoenix Suns have it all in total range for the team comparison of the game. Field goals with 63, three pointers with 50 percent, three throws were perfect at the line range 100 percent, fast break points was nine, points in the fight was only 36. And here on the other side right now, it's been a second chance points. Yeah, they've got 10 for Memphis Grizzlies, also along with another two that tends to be a punch point for 15 for Memphis. Only offensive rebound was putting up for on the team. The Phoenix Suns got an excellent of the run. A fantastic, very great amount of percentage here for Phoenix Suns. They've done so, so many of assists, turning out great. With defensive rebounds here for 22, three steals, which has been turning out here for the Suns. And there's only two blocks for Memphis Grizzlies, and only had one in the lead and five turnovers for less. Load of seven points off in the game. And also, four team fouls has been already been on the least their uh, favorite here for tonight. But six dunks with so many of them for the Memphis Grizzlies. And there is so much of a biggest lead here for the Suns. And time possession was only 12-24 for the Grizzlies. Yeah, that's definitely the true. The one thing we got to say is, it's a tough one to go back to Season 5. It's what everyone knows for sure. Keep an eye on here if you're looking for anybody's game. And now it's time to, res to present your three-star players of the game. You start up here, Terry Crews. Thank you so much. First for our star, as right now we start in towards the bottom. We got a great one to take. All three players goes big with Kevin Durant. 16 points, 5 rebounds, 5 assists, and only had one dunk performed. He had made out with a 28 performance run. And he had 11 field goals. Did great. Now for you, Wood Spoonie. Alright, number two, as we are about to be starting things up, it's going to be a one tough range to do another. Both scoring points, and this goes to Devin Booker. With 16 points, 3 rebounds, 2 assists, and a steal. That turned out 20 performance run, and had a great 6 out of 14 field goal percentage range, in tight range. So much effort that he could do, to take it all that he has. And definitely the pointer. They really say he's got a great effort and died. Then for number one, I go for DeAndre Ayton. 20 points, and he only had made that one with a steal, assist, and a rebounds for 11. 
and one dunk performed. He's the tallest man in the center. Can't figure out who was the best center in a guard position while playing for each teams. We don't know what will it be, because there might be one way, and it's a fascinating as ever since the last season, putting up an absolute win against the Atlanta Hawks. And as of right now, this regular, the preseason of the game has come to a finish. We made it toward the line, and we will be here a, taking an off day before the tip-off begins on December 3rd. That will be next month. And hey, mates, I will be here for the pregame show. We will along with Son of Beast, and there will be much plenty of commentators that will be here for the line. And definitely, the screen will be changing differently for the broadcasting for tonight. That is right. It's going to be a lot of that changing, and we got a lot of updates here for season number eight to be here to start on its run, and it's going to be a lot that epic. And yes, that is pretty exactly what we're going for. It's going to be awesome, it is. Now, it's going to happen most of the time. That's definitely true. Anyway, this has been a presentation of the NBA preseason of the 2K24. If you like to check out the previous uh, playlist, Check him out here on his channel in a playlist down below. In the meantime, thanks for watching and peace out folks for a while as the NBA 2K24 preseason dial. This is Terry Crews along with Wood Spoonie and Kevin Arnold and the crew. We wish you all see you later in the regular season of the game. And this is where we bring things for the fun and all competitions for exciting matchups of the new season of 2K Sports. Terry Cruz is out. Good night in Phoenix Suns of the Valley along with the Memphis Grizz of the downtown of Tennessee. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.